Good morning. I hope all of you are doing well and are, your week is off to a great start. We only had one video last week, but hopefully this week we'll be back on track for our every other day, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday uh, devotional thought. And I'm going to be taking a break today from Philippians. We're going to read in 1 Corinthians chapter 12, chapter 13, 1 Corinthians chapter 13 and verse 12. Uh, but before I read that text, I want to give you a math problem. And I want to see if you can solve this math problem. Um, so this is the math problem. You can pause the video, think a little bit about it, and then come back uh, to the devotional. The, ma the math problem goes like this. There was a captain who is ca has a ship, and on this ship he has 26 sheep and 10 goats. How old is the captain? All right, now we're going to go to our scripture reading. Uh, so if you're back with us, our scripture reading is 1 Corinthians 13 and verse 12. 13 and verse 12. For now we see in a dim mirror dimly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then I will know fully, just as also I have, uh, have been fully known. For now we see in a mirror dimly, but then face to face. So back to that math problem. Were you able to solve it? Did you come up with an answer? If you did, the answer was probably wrong. Or maybe you said to yourself, you know, this, this math problem is too complicated. I'm just not good at math. In that case, you're also wrong. <laughs> there is an answer to this problem, but it's not really a math problem. Um, it's interesting when this math problem was given to a m many students, they can't try to come up with all kinds of different answers. Some added the two numbers together. They added the sheep and the goats together, and they said, well, the, the man must be 36. But we know that, that you can't just add numbers of sheep and, and goats together and come up with the age of a person. Other people thought, well, they, they, they measured out how much each animal weighed about approximately and decided that the ship captain had to be a certain age to be able to even haul a load of that size. And so he had to, the captain had to at least be 28. They came up to that conclusion. But the real answer to this problem it, 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 there, is that there is no answer because we don't have enough information. If we had more information, we could find out how old the captain really is. Um, you know, we, and as we're studying scripture, sometimes we try to find out all the answers. We try to figure out what God's purpose for everything in life. But the better option is for us to learn how to trust God, even when we don't understand all of the answers. And the scripture that we read this morning talks about this idea that we understand partly right now. It's like looking through a mirror. And back then, your mirrors had a... Uh, they weren't is they weren't like the mirrors that we have today where you can see very real well. Uh, so when when we get to heaven, we are going to be able to see things even more clearly than we can today. God bless. Have a great day.